What's going on guys? It's a new day at a new park. We are at Castle Park in Riverside, which is my last park. Well, unless you count like family entertainment centers, but my last park in SoCal that I've yet to visit. I'm here with some really cool friends. We got Josiah, yes, Antonio, sir. Gio. What's up? And we're ready to have a pretty fun day, new park and new credits. So there's also like this really jank Wild Mouse Fabry thing and we're gonna ride that. It's gonna be uh, interesting, definitely interesting. But yeah, we're ready to have a good day. It is a Saturday today, so it's rather busy, but you know, we'll, we'll make do. But other than that, we're ready to have a fun time. So hope you guys enjoy the vlog, here we go. Just got off of the incredibly rare coaster model, this one being Screamin' Demon here at Castle Park. I have absolutely no words to describe what we just experienced. My balls hurt for one. <laughs> for two, the trims were very noticeable, let's just say that. Also, the free spinning was also very noticeable. I'm not gonna go super in depth, just come out and ride it. It's one of the funniest rides I've like ever been on. The laterals were actually pretty good though. That was the one redeeming quality, but what a weird ride. I wanna hear, I wanna hear you guys' reviews. What do you no, think? It was fun, it was fun. I mean, it was speeding around and the laterals are pretty good. Like it was, it's it's one of the weirdest credits ever. It's it's cool. Doing things that other spinners would not be doing. <laughs> Gio, what do you yeah, think? Yeah, it, it was pretty pretty decent, all things considered. Uh, laterals are good, so can't complain. I'm just glad I got the cred, man. It was cool. That was an experience for sure. Exactly. That was fun. And shout out to the park for escorting us up to ride it really fast because um. We told them what we were basically doing, which is reviewing parks on social media platforms, Instagram and YouTube, of course, with me and Josiah has national coasters. And basically they were able to help us out really quickly. So shout out to the park for that. It was really awesome. We're on Brothers Revenge here at yeah. Six Flags, just everything up. <laughs> we got Gio and uh, Antonio up here in the front. What's going on, guys? Just got off of Merlin's Revenge. I think that's the name of it. And that's funny because I just rode Riddler's Revenge yesterday. Easily my new number one, hands down over Falcon's Fury at Busch Gardens Tampa. That was amazing. What a f***ing amazing coaster. Yo, what did you guys think of your new number ones? Um, life changing. It's extreme, it's extreme. Very it's extreme. extreme, very intense. I, I'm at a loss for words. Watch this POV, by the way, on National Coasters. The commentary was like the funniest thing I've ever heard in my life. <laughs> but we're actually having a really great time and the park is beautiful. I forgot to mention, the park is absolutely gorgeous. There's very, very shaded areas with trees and the ride collection, albeit mostly family rides, is actually pretty solid. There's a lot of old school type of rides here. You can see the spider behind me. Genuinely a fun park and I'm glad we got to come out here. Even though it's a Saturday, we're getting a lot done already. So yeah, let's head on over to whatever we do next. Arms down, head back, and hold on.
As you just saw from that lovely POV video that Josiah just took and from my messy hair, we just got off of that super loop, which is actually my first super loop I ever rode. I mean, it was fun, but like it was really, really sketch. Literally, I don't know where we found a peacock. How did we just find this? That's pretty cool, dude. Bro, like, comment, subscribe. So I think right about now we're gonna wrap up the vlog. We just got off of our second ride on Screamin' Demon, which is that Jank Wild Mouse I talked about earlier, and it was really, really fun. It was definitely different that time around with a different train. Really interesting park, and it did remind me of Lagoon, actually. It's really pretty, and I would actually recommend it if you were in the area. Josiah, what did you think of Castle Park? Dude, Castle Park is really solid. Like, a lot of people kind of criticize it for being maybe a little jankier or more underground. It's not. Run by great people, lots of great <laughs> rides despite their age. Like, we had a great time here, so I'd highly recommend if you're in the area to stop in for a couple hours awesome employees too what do you think guys yeah for sure castle park's always a fun little stop i wish the log flume and dragon's tower were open today because i yeah. love the little mini shot towers but overall it was a super fun day it's a fun park it's well landscaped and the coasters are unique especially screaming demon i mean i guess merlin's isn't unique but the wild mouse is enough to get you out here and uh give it a try <laughs> yeah it was a really fun day i'm glad we all came out yeah definitely stop by if you have the time agreed yeah really fun park and i'll see you guys all in the next video bye guys